Hi and welcome. So in today's world when you buy a smartphone, usually um, most of the smartphones nowadays, they don't come with a charger in the box. So you have to go get a charger or if you have an old one lying around in your house. Um, problem is it's difficult to know what's the right kind of charger to buy and then you don't want to be carrying multiple bricks in your bag, um, one for the phone, one for the other phone, one for the laptop. So I did some research so you don't have to do. So that's why we call this place Simplified because I'm trying to simplify it for you, right? And I got some chargers that I think are very good. Um, this is made by Minix. If you can see that. Yeah, Minix. So this is a brick. It's pretty small in dimension as you can see in my hand really small but this is a 100 watt charger and it can charge basically all your devices at once 100 watts is good for any laptop uh, tablet phone smartphone of any kind um, modern smartphone it's got PD power delivery that means it can adjust to the power demand of your device if your device is also PD and most of um, the devices in 2022 they are, they are all power delivery so this will give the right amount of power to your device the advantage is that you have just one brick and you can use it for all your devices it's got three USB-C ports one two three and one USB-A port and they are all fast charging so this is 100 watt charger meaning that if you charge if you plug just the one USB-C you can get a maximum of 100 watts and that can charge your laptop and everything. And if you plug um, additional devices on any of the other USB-C's or USB-A, then the power will share. For example, if you have two USB-C plugged in the top two there, it will be uh, 45 watts and 45 watts each, something like that. Um, if you plug the three devices, then it will be 45 watts, 30 watts, and maybe uh, 20 watts, I think. I have the document here. So. If you plug all four of them, um, you will have 45 watts, 30 watts, 7.5 watts, 7.5 watts. So 7.5, 7.5 on the USB-A and the lower USB-C, and the other ones will be uh, 45 and 30 watts up there. Um, so it would share the power like that, and you just need this device and a couple of cables, USB-C and USB-A cables, and you are good to go. The good thing also is that it comes with different kinds of plugs so this is if you live in the US or you have this type this works for you but it comes with the pouch in fact it comes with the pouch that is inside so when you want to carry it it's easy to carry you fold it like this and it's and you throw it into the pouch and it's really soft and velvety pouch really good and you can throw that into your bag or you can carry it on the go um, if you do not live in the US there's a second pouch that it comes with that has additional adapting plugs so depending on uh, where you live or what kind of plugs you have this is i think is for australia or something like that you see that and then this is if you live in europe you use this kind and if you live in the uk you use this kind and in nigeria of course where i live so yeah so all you need to do is slide it in like this and you have adapted it you go to Europe, you slide it in like this, and you have adapted it. It is really good. I have a second one I've been using. This is a smaller one. This is the 66 watt, 66 watt. So it's got two USB-C and one USB-A. Um, the good thing about this one is it's smaller, of course. So it's if you look at the size compared to the 100 watts, you can see it's pretty small. Um, you see how small that is. So. Depending on your need, this can charge a maximum of 66 watts, so you can charge one laptop of 66 watt, and um, and then if you plug an additional device, of course, it will go down to maybe 45 watts or 30 watts, depending on whether you're using all the other plugs. It comes with a good uh, instruction manner that explains how the power is shared when you plug multiples, and like I said, it comes with all these adapters that you can use, and they work for any of them. So I've had this for long. I needed to buy the bigger one simply because. I want to charge my laptop at the same time with my phone and my
my laptop takes 65 watts so if i plug my laptop on this which is a maximum of 66 watts i cannot charge my phone with it again or i can charge two phones and, and then i can charge my laptop that's why I, I went to upgrade for the 100 watts which i can charge my laptop at the top for 65 watts and still charge uh, uh, one or two other devices my my uh, earbuds my phones my pen whatever i need to charge so if you're looking, if you're out there in the market looking for a good charger that can be like an all-in-one charger for your laptop and your phones, your tablets, all your devices, one on the go, I recommend these. I don't know, they're made by Minix. I don't have an affiliate link for them. I, do, I, I don't know them, but this is simplified. I find out things that I think you need and I share it with you. So thanks for watching. If you need to get it, it's just called Minix. You can search for it on, on Amazon. For the different sizes the 65 watts and the 100 watts um, i'll probably leave a link down below if, if, to make it easy for you um, so thanks for watching and see you in the next one